OK, having uh, set our Find Your Nearest options, the next thing we're going to want to do is start to populate our database with uh, items, in this case libraries, that people can search for their nearest of. Uh, OK, so we're going to add a new library. Adding a new library, we're going to add Keithley Library. Now here we would enter some content. Yeah, opening times, I don't know. Here, if we've opted, as we have, to display uh, excerpted results, um, just the excerpts, then this is where we would enter our shortened description for results. Now, we need to know where Keithley Library is. And we do this by entering the postcode in this section here but we also need to convert this into a form that the database can use to calculate distance. So we do this with uh, this button here. We're going to update latitude and longitude, which accesses the API and populates these uh, fields with the, area, uh, the latitude and longitude calculated from the postal area code. Um, the other thing that we've done is in our settings, we have opted to display the items, the library post, for example, um, with a URL that will incorporate the category uh, that it's placed under. When we do that, we need to place it under a category. It can't be found otherwise. So in this case, Keith is in West Yorkshire. So I'm going to place it in West Yorkshire. Now, the tags, the tags are slightly different. The tags enable your user to search for specific types of item. So for a library, for example, it could be a public library, it could be a college library. In this particular case, uh, Keithley Library is a public library, but if you wanted to give your users the option of searching for something like a, um, a college library or, or any other cat, um, type of item, then you would use the tags to do so. OK, so that's Keithley Library it's in West Yorkshire. I'm now going to publish. And Keithley Library is saved to the database.